Welcome to part two of Let's Check Out Dragon Warrior for the NES. So, I just realized I have a torch and I'm going to try to use it in the cave if I can freaking get in there without these slimes trying to cut me off. So, yeah, let me try this cave again and see if the torch works. Ah, there we go. Well, it works a little bit. Hope it don't go out like it does in Shadowgate. Alright, so there we go. Maybe I'll find that woman that's hidden in the cave that said, well, it's not really a cave. I guess it's like a basement or dungeon or something. Keep hitting the wall. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. Alright, come on now. So, I wonder if I'll find some sort of hidden treasure in here. Alright, so I did a quick cut because I was getting stuck. So, here we go. Here's the hidden treasure. I got the tablet. Tablet fault reads as follows. I am Erdrick, and thou art my descendant. Three items were needed to reach the Isle of Dragons, which is south of Breconary. I gathered these items, reached the island, and there defeated a creature of great evil. Now I have entrusted thee, entrusted the three items to three worthy keepers. Their descendants will protect the items until thy quest leads thee to seek them out. When a new evil arises, find the three items, then fight! Alright, great. So, let me see if I can even get that far in this game, because this will most likely be the last part of this last checkout, depending on how far I can get. Alright, that's enough. Here we are back outside of the cave or the dungeon or whatever back in the open field right, so I'm gonna run here I'm gonna get some items first before I fight anybody see if I can afford any items Dragon scale. Come on, is there any swords or anything I could buy in here? Yeah, not right now. Let's go this. No, wait. Did I talk, did I talk to people in here already? Yeah, I did. Never mind. Wait, let me go to this guy over here, see what he has. Yes, I do. Some weapons. Dang, I can't afford almost any of this except the club and the leather armor. I don't want leather armor. Or maybe that will reduce damage, but... Buy the club. I'm better than nothing right now. Yep, I'm about to go clubbing. No, I do not. Goodbye. What? Do I have the item? I th yeah, it looks like I'm holding it right there in my hand, so... Oh, it was, I've been doing that the whole time. I don't know, do I, do I got the club? Well, let's find out. Jeez, right in the first step out of the town, I get in a fight. Okay. The sucker punched me. Okay, is the club doing any damage? I'm even using the club. Good. All right, I want to go back into town and get some, buy some herbs, because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need it. So, a herb is a tool, okay? All right, so let's get out of here. Go back to the open field. Jeez. Again, the first step I take, I'm in a fight and against a freaking magician. Mm. Now, you know I'm not going to use the herb right now. 
I'm going to try to preserve it here, see how far I can get with this guy. Let's see if I need to preserve it. No, I better use it right now. Right, back to 15. Jeez, back down to 6. Really? Come on, man. Am I even using the club? Jeez. Oh. We knocked off seven points. Is that it? Oh, jeez. Nope. Of course not. Jeez. I get pwned by the black mage. Thou art dead. Yeah, and it should say thou art done because I am done with this game as far as playing it on YouTube is concerned. In the description box, it says, would this be the last part? Well, yep, it is. So this is the conclusion, and here are my final thoughts of the game so far. So I might play it some more, maybe. Um, but I don't know, so far the grinding is pretty frustrating. Almost everywhere you go, you run into a freaking enemy. I don't know if that's random or uh, depends on where you go, you run into an enemy. I don't know. But kind of think of it, maybe I should have bought the leather armor. I maybe would have survived a little bit longer. But anyway. Uh, so far, Dragon Warrior, eh. I don't know. Uh, I mean, I know I'm not into RPGs, but uh, the experience I have this game so far, the only thing I really, really don't like about it is just the constant, uh, I know in RPGs, in adventure games and stuff, grinding is normal, but in here, you know, I mean, it almost seems like <laughs> the first step I take, or every, almost everywhere I go, I just want to get to the next town, and then I gotta fight somebody at random, but, uh, I, th I feel like it happens too often in this game. Maybe that's normal. I don't know. But I've seen HVGN's quickie review of Dragon Warrior when he did a comparison of the NES version and the Game Boy Color version. And he compared how the Game Boy Color version, it doesn't take that long to level up like it does in the NES version. So I may have more fun playing that version instead of this one. But so far, I mean, well, I, I can't, uh, you know... I can't really say it's a bad game. Uh, this is my first impression of it so far. I'm about to maybe give it a 6.5 or 7 out of 10. It does seem interesting if I can actually get uh, kind of far in the game. But we'll see. Maybe I'll check out the Game Boy Color version as well. Maybe not on YouTube, but just check it out for myself just to see what that is like. And maybe I'll have more fun with that one. So with that said, I am out of here. I'm Ron Moore. God bless. Take care.